am I even okay? You know, I really am trying to reach for this camera more often when I am vlogging, but it just has not been happening the most naturally because I've had to adjust it too much. And I honestly can't really be bothered. The other one, it's always adjusted. It's always ready. It just always seems like an easier process. But this, on the other hand, I always have perfume on like my neck and stuff, but I like to dab my mask on me before. Obviously, I work in a hospital, and even though they've dropped the mandate, I still like to wear mine because I have people that I come home to, and I'm not trying to get them sick or anything. Well, I'm ready for work. Right now, I'm just sitting down waiting for my coworker, who's not here yet. It might take a while, but we're waiting. Last night, the census on my floor was so low. There were literally 14 patients. So we were overstuffed for the first in a very long time on my floor. So, you know, going in knowing what the census was, we already knew that they were going to float somebody. And they floated my friend. And she said she had a really smooth night where she went. The best thing while being floated is to float somewhere and actually have a good night because some of the floors are a tragedy and I feel like nine times out of ten too the problem is that we enjoy our home floor and we already have a process a system that we use when we all work together and so when you go somewhere else you don't know those people like that you're not really familiar with working with them and so that makes it a little bit more difficult when it comes to togetherness and like getting the work done but she said last night it was really good but the floor that she was on as well we also know that it's like a decent floor to be floated to so there was that we're going tonight one more night left and i'm off monday monday i have a doctor's appointment not too thrilled about it but like whatever can't even complain about these appointments anymore we're almost done with these appointments though i'm not gonna lie but um yeah, oh, I didn't check my blood pressure today. I have to do that. So I gotta sit and do that real quick. I have an appointment tomorrow. And I'm so annoyed because I've spent this entire week going back and forth with CVS. CVS at my doctor's office on the phone and it was just unsuccessful anyways so that's very debilitating the last appointment that i went to i had a few things that i had to take care of i had to get my t-dot vaccine i already got that barely felt that by the way um i had to go to the pharmacy about this shot that i did not get for the last month because The insurance company thinks that it's not necessary right now which essentially I don't think it is but this country likes preventative care and that is essentially what it's for at some point it's gonna be necessary but it's not right at the moment so when it is necessary they will cover it but right now they just won't um, and then I have some research that I have to do so maybe I'll leave this here because I didn't complete every single thing on there and I still need to do that, so. Mothballs. The only thing I'm going to do is spend so much time, like, struggling to clean and everything. And then I'm going to just go back and the places that I've cleaned just look crazy. <laughs> Wish I was making that shit up. It's a rainy day outside and I'm wondering if I want to wear sneakers or if I want to wear my Crocs. But honestly, my Crocs have really been saving my life these last couple of weeks. So I do think I want to wear my Crocs. Even if, because the last time there was this bad rain. Oh, it stopped raining. 
or lightly. The last time there was this batterine and I wore a pair of sneakers that has like, they were Adidas, they have like a little bit of, of a platform and I wore it thinking that would have been enough and then I took like a shortcut and they were soaked. I had to leave them outside on the stairwell for a couple of days for them to really get dry. And so I'd really prefer to not go through that with my sneakers at the moment. So yeah. I'm wearing this little denim because I'm basically just preparing for the morning, honestly. I don't want to have to do too much when it's time for my appointment. So yeah, and I have my vitamins with me so I can take in the morning. Always, oh. It just said it stopped raining and there it is outside again. You can't even. You can't even. Literally have $12 in cash in my purse. That is so sad. I don't know if I... I think I, I talked about this when I had gotten this MAC, right? There's another version of this that just sticks to the side like so. And it doesn't have to be dangling. And I really wish that I had bought it at the time. And I really hate buying things when I'm in like a pickle because I always end up finding something better and that makes more sense after I already have it. And I'm just like, I'm not about to replace this. So it's gonna have to just dangle. But the other one, we're gonna just keep it on the wish list for when this one goes back because at the moment I can't even. And because it's dangling like that, it's more susceptible to going back because um, like the cord. It's like when you wrap your chargers up, which is like, don't wrap my chargers up. I'm trying to make sure that I have enough snacks for tonight. I had some pineapple in here since... Yeah. Oh. Absolutely not. Well, that's not good. I love this little silicone bag I bought on Amazon. But at this moment... Oh my god, I'm glad it didn't leak through. My entire bag would have pineapple juice in there and that would not be great. So I'm going to have to pour this out. I'm like rinse this in the sink and leave it because the condition that it's in right now is bad. At work and tonight is one of those nights where we get two hours for break. And trust me, when I tell you that, I'm going to maximize it. I'm going to use 15 minutes to eat my little snack. I really don't have to eat it now if I don't feel like it. I could go sleep right now and then eat it when I go back. But I'm going to lay out and enjoy this break. Literally just coming home from work. Just took my scrub scap off, so I have my two braids out. I'm not really tired today, which is crazy because I didn't sleep on my break last night. Not really complaining. I'm kind of starving though. I need to do something about the fact that I'm starving. I just took a train. It was very, very quick. I said I wanted to try and make some stew peas for the last like two days now, but honestly, I have not been feeling the momentum and considering the fact that I just took the train and walked for a good 10 minutes. That's not going to be happening today. I think we should have some food in the fridge, so there should be something to eat. I don't really know. I also think that I might eat some cereal for breakfast. I have to go see if there's milk. I don't know that there's milk, but I don't know that there isn't either. Yeah, last night was a pretty decent night. Last night was one of my friend from my old job's birthday. She's now at the new job that I am working at. There's quite a few of us there from the old job. And so um, Jules and I went downstairs. Jules and I and another one of our friends also from the old job that now works at the new job. We went downstairs and we bought her um, an ice cream cake from Duncan. And we went up there to surprise her with it she was still surprised but it was kind of it was very awesome too she's like oh my gosh you guys and you know we sang a little happy birthday and cut the cake and ate so that was kind of exciting not really somebody dm'd me on instagram and told me how to clean off my <coughs> am i even okay Somebody direct messaged me on Instagram and told me how to clean off 
my nightstand. I think he said vinegar and what? Let's see. Baking soda and water. Where did I get vinegar on God he knows. So I might try that today. I'm also not really sure. I'm just saying a lot of things right now that I'm not really sure about. But I'm going to change and see what I want to do if I want to. If I want to lay down, if I want to find something to eat, I don't really know yet. We're just going off of vibes here, so we'll see. I really want to save my battery life for tomorrow because I have some plans for tomorrow. But I went in today and I did my lashes. Again, because I have some plans for tomorrow. And this is what they look like. Can y'all even see? I'm going to also put the before so y'all can see. And I love them. They were so quick. Just in case y'all ask. On the Amazon. I think I have a link to my Amazon storefront. And the Ardell. That's what I used. Anyways, ready for work and should be leaving. So, I'll see you guys later. Mm -hmm.